think we have shots fired. I just heard somebody pop off. I heard a gun go off, and this guy's running up the hill. Uh, we're gonna go in and get the rifle out. Oh, it's it's a it's a, a friggin' lion's attacking him, and he just kicked the shit out the lion. Holy crap! What is going on? Hey guys, what's going on? I'm back with another video in this video here today. We're playing some more LSPDFR, but this time we're doing this video upon viewer request to show off this livery, 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 I, I don't know. Uh, so this, it's actually kind of hard to see because it's uh, it's 4 o'clock in the morning. It's just a nice bright and early, well actually dim and early time. Uh, to be doing stuff, I figured uh, I'd mix things up, use a vehicle I don't normally use in a part of the map I never go to at a time of day I never show. Uh, let's just mix it up. So somebody hit me up on Twitter, uh, or maybe... Their name is, uh, is or their, their, their screen name, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Matt Grimes, who I guess designs liveries. There's a, I guess a bunch of people that do that. Uh, and basically uh, wanted me to make a video showing this one here is a constable livery. Uh, you can kind of see. It. So ba basically because the car is white and the font's kind of light, you can kind of barely see it there. Uh, I've actually seen, first like I thought something was wrong with it. But then when I think about it and I look at the screenshots of it, I guess that's the way it's supposed to look because... I have actually seen uh, cop cars, like in real life, where, well, I guess it's actually like black and then the text is kind of black. Like, it's kind of like sort of undercover. Like, you can see it if you look. Um, but basically, so, so like a constable, uh, you know, co people, you know, associate constables really more often with the UK than in the US. But there actually are constables uh, in the US and the, they're not police, but in the sense that my understanding how it works, like just from working in law, uh, not law enforcement, like just law, like, well, yes, yeah, it gets interesting sometimes. So like, for instance, like if I, uh, you know, uh, like, you know, I'm, I'm filing a lawsuit on behalf of a client against somebody else, uh, what happens is a constable, um, as they're called, has to, the, the legal requirement is, is hand delivery. So you have to walk up to the person and say, here, you've been served. And then that, you know, if they don't come to court. Uh, then they're screwed, but basically a constable is the person that goes around, gives out court documents, you know, like if you're not paying child support, or anytime the a court has to give somebody papers, a constable, more often than not, is the one that's doing it. You can see the sun's coming up now, uh, so that's why we're showing off, or it's not why, we're showing off because somebody asked, but uh, nonetheless, that's what a constable does, at least in the U.S. In the U.K., I'm not as sure. But um, anyways, just from my experience, that's, that's that's what the constable does, in case you were wondering. So I figured I'd come to this, let's go ahead and start driving. So I figured I'd come to this part of the map, because I never come here, never this time. It's always like a downtown, bright and sunny patrol with the black and white. So I figured we'd, we'd kind of mix it up here. This is the park ranger car. Actually, what I wanted to look at, well, I was flapping my gums there. Oh, look at the bunny rabbits, look at that, huh? Uh, I saw the inside of this house. You could, like, I don't know if there's, like, an interior to it, but, like, I see, you can see, like, inside the windows there. I just want to go check out this house. And we, we really don't have, like, probable cause or anything. I just want to see if there's an interior, because I'm kind of curious. So we'll swing around here. We'll get over to this house. See what's up with the house. So, uh, oh, hold on. I gotta go on duty. Whoops. Oops. Sorry. Oh, crap. Hold on. That, that just screwed this whole thing up. Cancel that. I don't, I don't need to record anything. Shut that off. Okay, that's been saved. Uh, there, there we go with that. And then there we go with that. And I'll go ahead and back. So I guess I... Was I already on duty? Yeah, oh, well, there's a call out, so I must have been. Felony stop assistance. So we're going to get over to that. But before... Well... Alright, I'm coming back to this house to see if it has the interior. Just because I'm curious. And we kind of want to be in this part of the map. This is taking, a little, taking us a little bit out of the way where we normally want to... Uh, place we want to be. It says code 3. We're going to go code 3 of this one. Does only have lights on the front? Yeah, it only has lights on the front. There's already a helicopter in the air. So I'm assuming this one's kind of serious. They're going to tell us to get their code 3. That was first person. Look, oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. So we'll get over this one. Nice graphics, by the way. Definitely nice graphics. Um, I don't know what ENB this is. I think it's like just that, that one that people use for LSPDFR. But, uh, I'm kind of disappointed this thing only has lights on the front. You know, it's kind of... Disappointment there. I guess that's kind of where they... Eh, they should be on should be on the front and the back, or should be visible on the front and back. Anyways, that's what you get with one of these, like, slick top, unmarked cars, so... Anyways, uh, it says felony stop assistance, so I guess we're going to a vehicle as opposed to an address. Using the phaser here to get through the traffic. Get 
people to get out of the way. See, it's, it's at 6.30 in the morning. You can see the clock uh, on the bottom left there, a little right above uh, the heading. Um, so we've got that rush hour traffic. All right, here we go. Oh, my God. Look at this one. Who, who's, who are we stopping, the truck or the convertible? All right, hold on. Let's get behind cover here. Uh-oh. Pressing you. Get out! He's got a gun! Alright, suspect down. Let's go ahead and get EMS. Holy smoke. I wasn't even behind cover there because that car pushed this cop car out the way. Oh man, let's go ahead and grab that evidence. Uh, holy smokes. So you saw that heli orbit mod I have, so it basically just sends a helicopter to the crime scene automatically. Hey, that's based on an Audi. Look at this. See this car here? I think it was like the Audi Q5. This red car, because I went and I test drove it, because I was almost going to buy it, and I went with the Mercedes instead. There's like certain cars I can recognize the real car that they're based on. The GZA. Alright, so EMS is on scene. We're code 4. We're going bang out of here. I'm going to head back towards where we're going. I want to check out that house. It's like a suspicious... Not suspicious. I just want to see if that house had an interior. I think that's kind of interesting. Sorry, light! Oops! What is, oh, 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 what is this guy doing? All right, sir. We're going to pull this dude over here driving like a lunatic. Order him to stop. Uh, let's go ahead and just get off the road here so we're like off to the side. I got to say, the AI are a disaster at pulling off to the side. They really are. All right, let's see what this guy's deal is. It's for identification. Good God, uh, Felix Johnson. All right, this guy totally looks way older than being born in '94. Um, go ahead and search that in a minute. I'm gonna search it now, I guess. Felix Johnson. Let's see what we got. License is expired. No worries. This guy's driving an expired license. Um. Issue penalty, issue warning, order. Can we let him drive on an expired license? I mean, I believe that if the license was revoked, then I think he's got to go to jail for it. But if it's just expired, I don't know if that's a criminal. Well, I'm not bringing him to jail. Just cause, like I, I don't know. Like I know somebody that just went to renew their license a few days ago, and it's like, should you go to jail? Because you're, I, mean, I, I don't know. I. I I'm not really bringing the guy to jail for that. I mean, if it was like drugs and it was revoked, then fine. But we're just going to go in and give him a, a, you know, a penalty for it. Fine. Uh, $20. So. And this guy will be on his way. He sent the message. How long is this taking? Holy smokes. All right, penalty. $20. Category. Oh, oh, I see. So we have to select what it's for. All right, uh, no, driving on, it's not suspended, it's just expired. So expired license. That's new, I've never seen that one before. Did LSPD4 update itself? Because it never used to have that, and I, I don't think I've updated it. Uh, points? What does points mean? One? Yeah, so like one count of it, you mean? Uh, not season vehicle ticket. There we go, that's what it was. So you gotta, you gotta say what it's for. There we go, that's pretty cool. I wish I could shut the siren off from here. I got to be a bit much. Uh oh, is it gonna rain? It might rain. Holy crap. Yeah, write the ticket. Let's go. It doesn't take that long. There we go. Alright, we're back on our way. Shut this damn siren off. Let's see if that house had an interior. Because it looked like it did. I was looking in the window of that house, and it looked like it did. It looked like it had an interior. What are you doing? What the hell is. What are you. I don't get it. Can we, uh... Why is he talking? He's like, just talking to nobody? Uh, how do we... Oh, hold on a side. I got an idea. Um, this is a pro tip right here. You ever get stuck with this? Mm, do that. And you're out of it. There we go. Alright, let's go, bud! Oh, yeah. I totally forgot to tell you. So I got this part. Why the hell are you getting... What are you doing? What are you doing? Cancel. But just press F. Is that going to start doing it? No. Alright, we get in the car. He starts doing it. 
Right? Is he gonna get out? Yeah, he gets out. Get out. Get in. And he gets out. I cancel it. He gets in. He gets out. Cancel it. Gets in. He gets out. All right, I have no idea why he's doing that. That is bizarre. That is very, very bizarre. Um, do we need a new car? I don't know why it's doing that. Um, no, he didn't get out this time. So, yeah, so we got a... a, a, a okay, I don't know why this guy's getting in the back. Oh, we have, like, a machine gun in the... Holy smokes, look at that. Yes, we do. Um, so I got, I got, a, got a partner for this, uh, this, this patrol. We, we got a... Got a partner with us here for the sheriff, because... LSPDFR doesn't have a partner in it. I don't know why. It just doesn't... The LCPDFR did, but I guess it's probably because it's really easy to just have one yourself. Just use the trainer. So we're going to go over this house, check this thing out. Speed limit 50. I, I noticed since the... I don't know if it was the gun running DLC, or if it was... Um, hold on a minute. I have to... I have to hit the road, like in real life. I have to leave and like... Friggin' 15 minutes. See, that's a problem, because I'm playing GTA, and then now I'm going to go drive in real life. Like, you kind of need, like, you need to cool off for a little bit, you know what I mean? You, you don't want to just, like, go from GTA to real life. It's a, whoa, okay, sir! Sir, all right, I guess we're not going to that house. Things keep interrupting us. Sir! You're like, friggin' Mr. Magoo. Driving out of control over here. Flying around corners and stuff. We didn't do any constable stuff. We should have, like, gone to, like, serve people papers. Holy crap, sir. Say to to stop. I don't know if he's stopping or not. There we go. We're going to go in and get code 2 back up two times. Oh! You have a shots fired! I think we have shots fired. I just heard somebody pop off. I heard a gun go off, and this guy's running up the hill. Uh, we're going to go in and get the rifle out. Oh, it's it's a it's a, a friggin' lion's attacking him, and he just kicked the shit out the lion. Holy crap! What is going on? This guy just ran up the hill after a lion, and he and he in the he, the lion's attacking him, and he just kicked the lion. Got like friggin' Chuck Norris over here. Holy crap! This guy is badass. I mean, he's like white trash as hell, but I mean this guy. Holy crap! Oh, he's got a gun. Holy crap! Holy smokes! Alright, you might want to rewind that one. So, what just happened there? It's getting EMS. I pull over to this guy. I pull up to this guy here. He's driving like crazy. We pull him over. As I'm getting out of the car, I hear a gunshot. So I take the rifle out, and I see this guy running up the hill. And I think, like, okay, this guy must be shooting at somebody. I don't know what's going on. And then I look up the hill, and a lion's attacking him. I'm thinking, oh, wait a minute. He needs help. So I, I go to shoot the lion, but he like kicks it with his foot. And I run up the hill to see if he's alright. And he pulls out a gun. Alright, now we gotta see what this guy's situation is. This guy's driving like an asshole. Um, oh, it's a lady too. Oh my god, this lady's like a friggin' spoiled, like, Napa Valley trophy wife right here. Alright, let's get the ID on her. Jess Freeman, what is this? My phone's going off now. All right, hold on a second. Uh, let's just get that ID. I need it. It is. I'm going to check. Jess Freeman. There we go. Or 1984. License is expired. Is everybody's license expired today? All right. Well, I'll tell you what. Just because she's driving like such an ass, uh, I'm going to give a penalty. Select defense. Um, driving on a suspended license. No, uh, expired license. Reckless driving. Michael's driving. Michael's in danger. Ah, nobody is in the car, but she was driving really aggressively. We can give her that. Uh, and the fine for that, I guess, uh, presets to $4,400. Uh, we'll go ahead and issue the ticket. Okay. So. Alright, guys. What's well, going to do for this video? hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, sort of thing. Uh, up, up next, I have, an, uh, I have a few LSPDFR videos that I have ideas for that I'm going to do. So those will be coming out uh, right quick. But other than that, until next time, that's going to do for this one, guys. Thanks for watching.